You get four goals on the road. You should probably win that hockey game, shouldn't you? We should have won the game. And we had a, uh, and we played a good enough hockey game to win a hockey game tonight. And uh, just the mistakes, I mean, uh, uh, critical mistakes too. Like we have a good first period, we get the first goal lead. You know, they had a push, but in the second period, uh, just, you know, we're trying to do too much our, our, ourselves, like too much one-on-one -on -one hockey. Ford gets caught in deep uh, in the offensive zone. Uh, but I love the response in the second. You know, we come and tie it up and, uh, you know, we show some jam, but, you know, we have the puck on our stick and we just can't make these critical mistakes. Uh, and we're just ending up in our net. Why can't the guys sustain momentum? You get two goals in a minute and 15 seconds to tie the game after you had given up three. We We did have momentum after we tied the game. I know, Paul. but how come you can't sustain it? They we did, we were in the goal. offensive zone. We were in the offensive zone with the puck on our stick. And we turned the puck over. That's, we still had momentum at that point, but we, we turned the puck over and it comes back and it winds up in our net. So Did what's you? the frustration level when these mistakes are being made by your prime players? Jack drops the coverage, Sam with a turnover, wrist the line. And I mean, these are your prime guys who you have to rely on to win. Well, this is the thing we continue to talk to our players about is our checking detail. And uh, we're going to continue to talk, talk about it because it's so important. And when we don't have the puck, you can see it. We have to have a bigger commitment without it. And you're playing against good teams that are fighting for their playoff lives. They have a good transitional game, and, and it ends up in our net. So we got to continue to that message. It's, that's the frustrating part. How did you, how'd you think Alex handled the matchups he was seeing? I thought Alex played a heck of a game tonight. Not because he scored. I thought he was skating well. Uh, he was getting down and deep in the corners, uh, controlling the puck, hanging on pucks. He got a couple looks. Uh, it was a heck of a shot on the power play. Your fate was determined, obviously, in the race a few weeks ago, but tonight you're officially eliminated. I mean, how just disheartening is it to see what happened to this season from where it was in November to well, where it's, you're it's now? It's tough. Yeah, we, we didn't want to be in this position. Uh, you know, we got a young team, we, and, uh, um, and I'm saying we, even with Jack and, and, and Reinhardt and uh, Risto, these guys are still young. And uh, um, so, you know, you know, we'll f make that evaluation tomorrow and look at the game, but um, there's a lot to play for and a lot to prove right now. Do you still believe, I mean, these guys are young age-wise, but we're talking two, three hundred games for a lot of these guys in the NHL. That's not really a young player, is it? Well, I believe, uh, you know, that they have it in them. I think they're in that, I believe in that group that's in the room, and, uh, you know, we have to stick together right now. It's obviously not where we want to be, and that's the, that's the frustrating part of it. Thanks,